up, peeps? It's your girl, Dodge. Come back from all takes. Well, it looks like we have a trailer for The Exorcist Believer. Now, this one, I've been waiting for something to drop, being that this does come out on October 13th, Friday the 13th. Now, I remember hearing about this a while back. This was in the works. I know the director, David Gordon Green, I'm a fan of some of his previous work in horror, so that right there had me truly intrigued. I love the original. That was probably not the first horror movie scene, but one of the ones I remember seeing back when it first came out, I was very young, I want to put my age out there, but needless to say, being of course starring Linda Blair, Ellen Burstein, definitely a fan of it, definitely creepy, <laughs> watching it as a young child, and knowing that we're getting to see uh, another, somewhat of a uh, retelling, re-imaging of it, I'm curious to see how the storyline is going to progress, if it's going to be somewhat similar to the original with Linda Blair as Reagan, you know, McNeil, and of course the mother as well. Uh, so I'm curious. Also, I think if I'm not mistaken, Ellen Burstyn is in this one. I know Leslie Odom Jr. is in this one. I think Linda Blair is in this one, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, I don't think they're going to show anything with her in it, right? They might want to keep that on wraps. I can't say anything until I actually watch it. I will do. I will say one thing. I did see last week a couple of posters were actually dropped, and I did post one on my social media. So the young young girl, poor thing, looks very creepy. So I'm already here for that. So with that said, let's go ahead and jump into it. Say those some thoughts at the new guys. Good day. Hey, be home by dinner. I love you. Good morning, Mr. Fielding. Good morning, Catherine. And here are your daughters, Angela and Catherine. It's about seven hours ago, and that's the last information we have. Catherine! Angela! If you can hear this, we love you. Please come home. Hey. Hey, you found her? We and Catherine doing out there in those woods. They're just walking and walking. It's fine. Angela, can you tell your dad how long you were gone? It's a few hours. Baby, you've been gone three days. went they brought something back with them. The body and the blood of Jesus Christ. people out there who have. You have some experience with possession. Yes, more than I'd like. I believe you can help get our girls back. Exorcism is a ritual. Every culture, every religion, they all use different methods. It's going to take all of them. We've met before. Mother. What did you do? you guys I really did enjoy this trailer I like the difference in storyline definitely not doing exactly what they did in the first one from 7 was 73 I think that's the right year if I'm not mistaken um, with this one you know girls at school but then you see where 
they end up, I don't know, wandering off, you know, in the woods. I, I, I wonder if we'll actually hear from them exactly how that came to be. Why did you end up on there instead of being in class? What happened? And then seeing that, you know, one of the young girls, and one of them I actually did recognize, she's from a couple of movies in the past, um, in a TV series I remember seeing. When the girl, she's like, you know, missing, I think she had two days. He said, you've been missing for three, two hours, excuse me, and he said three days. So very interesting when you see some of the scratches and cuts on the young girl's leg and then that little moment where they kind of, you know, lock eyes and hands go up with their arm up and things start happening, you know, one of the girls hearing things, dad's like, no, and then another girl showing up at the church. I'm just like, oh my God, creepy. But I like how there's like, you know, is there someone who can, you know, help them understand this stuff? And it's like, there's one person, one person who's kind of, you know, studied it, whatever, which is the character, I want to say, is it Chris McNeil, if I'm not mistaken, played by Ellen. And I like the part where she eventually shows up with one of the girls and, you know, they kind of let on. It's like, you know, like, yeah, like I'm aware of you as we've met. <laughs> and curious how when she gives them ideas certain things they need to go through being I think she tried with the, her daughter to, until eventually the priest come into the picture it's going to be very interesting to see how they do it because of course you know we were only dealing with Reagan in that one this one we have two <laughs> double the horror aspect of this whole situation so that definitely is something that has me intrigued that they you know with that difference in storyline changing up a little bit you know not one but two I'm really curious that we see you know Ellen's character I'm really hoping we do get to see Lyndon I'm glad they didn't show this I don't need to see another trailer this is enough for me <laughs> they might have another one don't need another one I really hope somebody doesn't ask me don't ask me I really just want to go see this you know with you know what they've given us this is nothing it was a very lengthy trailer at that so again truly did enjoy this one i love that they use the music you know original music from the film love that little touch you know so with that said you guys comment below let me know what you think and with that said i'll see you guys next uh trailer reaction you guys take care